Remember also taking care of the immune system isn't just eating well and taking different kinds of herbs, it's also lifestyle. So if you don't get enough sleep at night or if you're stressed out, this affects your immune system. So if you have, you're constantly raising your stress hormones like cortisol, cortisol is actually quite immunosuppressive and interferes with you know, the, normal, uh, the normal kind of action of the immune system. So sleep, recuperation, rest, meditation, laughing with your friends, you know, these are all really important things that actually will also help your immune system. Supporting the adrenal glands, so this is also important here as well because actually cortisol competes with another female hormone called progesterone and you know what, cortisol will win. So, that, so when you have a situation where you've got elevated estrogen levels and you've got lower progesterone levels and you've got high cortisol levels, you're going to end up in a situation potentially where the whole cycle is out or the woman is, is, is experiencing physical or, or mental unwanted symptoms. From my point of view, it's quite difficult to get perfect results in terms of hormone balancing if you don't take care of your adrenal glands. And remember, you've only got those for life. They are there, they are yours, and you want them to see you through into your menopausal years. And sometimes some ladies are very, 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 very tired when they go through the perimenopause because they've had quite a difficult life where they've worked long hours, they've got very stressed out. So you want to nurture these glands really from when you're little to, to kind of, you know, to the end of your life.